What's up gamers? Six Cause Gaming here, back out again with another video. Yesterday I'm changing my intro, but today I got this for my birthday. Yesterday, so it was the 14th. Sorry there was no birthday vlog. I wanted to, but my parents probably don't support my channel as much as I want them to. Yeah, but anyway, uh for my birthday today, I got the Spring Trap Funko 6 inch spring trap plush i'm pretty sure i just said spring trap twice but we're going to review them so let's get into this review to start things off spring trap is much is less softer than the others so if i take a freddy here who's always been the soft one of the softest he's like really soft and plushable well um spring trap he's a little bit of rough but not sticky and rough like Phantom Foxy. Get out of here, Freddy. I love his feet. I get... So, in the game, Springtrap has, like, these lines that are actually veins and, like, pieces of his flesh that are on his feet. I guess that's meant to represent it. I love his gray feet and... He's just so mangled. I mean, look at all the rips and tears. He's, it's like, um, where is he? So he's got this thing right here. It goes all along his his stomach. It's like Nightmare Freddy. His goes all the way around his stomach. Now get out of here, Nightmare Freddy. Lord. Spring Trap's eyes. They're like the only green-eyed... He's now the only green-eyed animatronic that I right now have. And his nose is a different texture, like, I take Freddy again. His nose is like a plasticky thing, like from an Easter egg. Springtrap's nose is fur. But I, and I really like his uh, wires that come out. Uh, these are actually string uh, with other string inside it. I think the red ones are representing his veins and stuff. And then the black one is representing his um, wires. I love how he has all that pink stuff to represent how the purple guy is inside him. His teeth are a different texture. So if we just grab any Nightmare. Nightmare Freddy again because he was closest. Nightmare Freddy's teeth is like those that that uh that rubbery substance. While Springtrap's teeth is like that hardened plasticky flexible surface. I think that makes him look cool. It makes it. I mean, I think it makes him look more withered. Um, I love how much detail they put into Springtrap, like the rips in in his eyes. Well, on the sides of his eyes, obviously. Get out of here. You're not part of this review. But anyway, um, he can go derp. So yeah, derp in three, two, one. <laughs> Did you guys like it? I hope you did. But anyway, uh, the back of Springtrap, not much except for that little back thing, which Springtrap actually has. His stomach is like, a, and a uh, muzzle are like, little bit brighter shades of green. I say a little bit because on the camera it looks like a lot. But, um, yeah, but, I, when, on, in the personal view it looks lighter. Um, and his, the insides of his ears are lighter. I love how they did this. The spring trap actually has part of his ear and the endoskeleton torn off. Not like Mario Muffet Adventures where the whole back of spring trap's ear is burned off. So, uh, rip Mario Muffet Adventures spring trap. I don't know why I did the animation to me putting my hand up and then doing it. I don't know why, but maybe it's because I forgot to pause my thing. But anyway, uh, let's get back to this review. Springtrap, I love how his ear has been torn off and then they put wires here. I would have loved it if they had put like one more, one wire like here and like two more. One vein right here and then two more wires like right here and here. I think that would make him look a bit more detailed. And then... There's, like, supposed to be this little gray thing here that's representing his endoskeleton. Yes, he still has that. Um, he's, his endoskeleton, uh, he should, like, as you can see by this ear, 
he should have his little endoskeleton part of the ear sticking up and then the wires. So, but all in all, uh, I haven't taken his tag off yet. He is non-exclusive, so you can find him anywhere. So, yeah, uh, at the bottom it would say Walmart exclusive or Target exclusive. Like, I still keep Phantom Foxy's tag. It's only at Target. All in all, I love how Springtrap turned out. He is a great Springtrap. So, everybody, here is my plushy collection. If you guys are wondering how many Funko FNAF plushies I've got, I've got 13. See? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I don't know why I had to count that out loud, but all in all, Springtrap is now one of my favorites. I don't know why. He's so cool, though. Of course, Foxy will still be my favorite, but Springtrap turned out really good. I really like how he came out. Yeah. But anyway, guys, that's the end of the video. If you did enjoy the video, please do slash the like button with your talents. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to join my real talents army. And also be sure to follow me on Musical.ly, at Six Claws or at Six Claws Gaming. I don't know which one will work. Try both of them. I recommend trying at Six Claws first, but um, if that doesn't work, try at Six Claws Gaming. But anyway, guys, that's the end of the video, and I'll see how you do the next one. Bye!